In this series of tutorials, we will discuss searching library catalogs and journal article databases using keywords, subject headings, and subject terms. The first thing to understand is the difference between keywords and subject headings. Let's start with keywords. When you carry out research in a database or library catalog, you will want to start with a research question and then break that question down into searchable keywords based on the major concepts in your question. You can't simply type full sentences or questions into library databases or catalogs and expect to find useful or relevant results. Many internet search engines such as Google Scholar also require you to use searchable keywords in order to maximize the relevance of your search results. Keywords are single words or short phrases that describe the main or key concepts of your topic. These words or phrases can be found anywhere within a book's catalog record or anywhere within a journal article's record in a database. This includes within the title of the article or book, the publication information, or the abstract. Subject headings are different from keywords because they are assigned by a subject specialist to an item in a library catalog, such as a book or a DVD, from a predetermined list of possible subject terms. Subject headings describe very specifically the content of the item by combining different keywords in a structured manner. Most academic library catalogs in North America use Library of Congress subject headings, or LCSH. This means that you can use the same subject headings to search across all libraries that use LCSH. Athabasca University Library uses LCSH, as well as Library and Archives Canada's Canadian subject headings for topics related to Canada. In library catalogs, you find subject headings under subject in an item's record. Databases usually do not use subject headings. However, most databases have their own subject terms that were created by subject experts, and these subject terms usually differ from database to database. Some databases even have a thesaurus or subject terms list that you can use to easily carry out subject term searches. In most databases, you can find subject terms in an item's record, but they may be described differently across different databases. For example, the database Academic Search Complete calls them subject terms, whereas Web of Science calls them keywords, and ProQuest databases use subject. <laughs> 